dead. We mourn the loss of our future king and hope for East Anglia. We will remember his brave fight in Dunwich. We will remember his sword against ruins. And above all, we shall remember the man's devotion to God and his mission. Another king lost Abel. Stop washing your face with mead. How can I face half Don Yarl now? I fail him again. You have not failed him. Root's clan is badly weakened. We can still cure what ails these lands. What Thanes would risk their asses now? Oswald was the last with even a scrap of courage. We can take the battle to what remains of Root's clan, before they hit back. Easier said than done. His men are holed up in Borg Castle, a fortress on the sea. On the sea? Then it must have a harbor. It does. Guarded by a gate of hefty iron held in place by timber spikes, difficult to force open. Timber burns. It does, but how do we reach it? We rig your ship with oil at her front, and sail it ablaze at the gate. They would see us coming, long before we reached the walls. We raise a beard, an army of East Anglia's farmers. Throw them at the front gate as a distraction. <laughs> Saxons willing to die for a bunch of Danes? It's a stretch. It can work, Finir. If they fight in Oswald's name, that is all the courage they will need. <laughs> you there! Did you hear of Thane Oswald's fate? Aye, we did. He dragged Ruid to the bowels of Elba, Dane devil. Ruid may be gone, but his clan still plagues East Anglia. And would you join us to rid your kingdom of his dogs? For Oswald? Aye, anything. Two eager Saxons is not yet defeated. But you may be right. We may have a chance. I can ride to Elmenham and muster what remains of Oswald's men there. But who else would join us? The Reeve of Thaleford, Winston. He's a bitter old barnacle, but he would fight to the death for this land. We can assemble a forward camp at the ruins north of Boer Castle. Ride with me, Fenir. Let's pay this Reeve a visit. With any help? Theovort remains untouched by Ruid's violence. Hope is a scarce word in this kingdom. Maybe so, but I would rather hold on to something, anything, than ride with empty hands. If Ruid's clan continues to roam this kingdom unchecked, the people of East Anglia will be as ravaged as these lands. And where do we find ourselves? Riding into defense to beg a horde of frightened farmers for aid. To fight for a king that you gave them, Fenir. Remember that. It was my task to find them a king, not protect that king against every danger that might befall him. Oswald wasn't crowned yet, nor was he married. I say you have some work yet to do. Right, right. No need to remind me how far I've done short. Watch your back. Ruid's clan will still be nearby. Sword and silver. We had a bit of fun. That's what matters. Its men are a blight on this land. Blight is too kind a word. A serious curse. Theobald, just ahead. Wood smoke and ash. Wood's men have been here. Oh, my child. So no time to waste what the Lord has given us. Eat, so you'll have strength. Everything is gone, Reed. Really. Everything. Ah, oh, my friend, we will rebuild, I promise you. We ain't got the strength no more. Stand tall. 
<laughs> Not a will of iron coming here, knowing your kind did all this. Ruid's clan is your enemy, not me. I come on behalf of the late Oswald of Elmenham. You're still a Dane from top to two. It's your meddling that led to Oswald's death, leaving our kingdom for the worse. Oswald died defending East Anglia, defending you. Will you not do the same? What? Die in defense of a lost cause? I have problems of my own. East Anglia will fall if Ruid's clan is not defeated. Fight with me to drive them off for Oswald and your kinsmen. Pretty words, Dane. But the men of Theovard have their own battles to fight. If you need an axe, I'm standing right here. There's a village to the east, Kingsbury. It was taken by Ruid's men a fortnight ago. And I'll not rest until it's back in our hands. Let me and my raiders take the village, save your strength, and join us for the fight to come. Bold offer. If you do as you promise, the pikes at Theavard will be yours. I will take this news to our forward camp, Abel. Follow when you can. I will see you there. Kingsbury's church has a great horn atop its steeple. If you manage the task, blew it. And I'll know you kept your word. if you will. You called to me. We heard you talking with the Reeve, and we wish to fight beside you. We owe Oswald for his good deeds and fair rule. I'm glad to hear it. Go to the ruins north of Buch Castle. The army gathers there. I must be careful now.
Kingsbury. Infested with Rhodes men.
and signal victory. has come to join me. Let's hope his promise holds. The horn! It's been so long since I've heard that sweet sound! Praise be! Heildane! Over here! I held to my oath, Reeve. I hope you will honor yours. My promise holds, I. They of Ord will join you in the fight against Ruid's clan. With your aid, we may yet save East Anglia. In past times, that horn was used to muster fears all across our land. You may find others who have warmed to its call. Good. Whatever willing men you find, rally them soon at the ruins north of Burt Castle. Fieldward has answered the call. I should join Finia in our forward camp. Hmm. Thor lends me strength. <laughs> well met. Information. I have it. Do you need it? Well worth a little silver, I assure you. All right. Now, show me your map. There is a place... here. This must have got to them. The brothers' fleet, gathered and ready. Let's go. Word of your actions in Thaevorn has spread like wildfire. 
Men are pouring in from across East Anglia, and our ships stand ready. The Edward's Reeve is with us. Its men will be here soon. More than his. The Kingsbury Horn has inspired men all across this kingdom. We will have the army we need. It seems Oswald got what he wanted in the end. Saxon and Dane, united in common cause. A pity he is not here to see it. The forces will be ready soon. Are you ready to start the assault? I am. Our target is Burg Castle, said to be impenetrable. Good. Let them have their false confidence. By cover of night, Baldus will lead the field at the front gates. With Ruid's men distracted, our forces move on the sea gate from the backwaters at their backs. And once we're in, we'll leave no gate closed in that castle. Ruid's men cannot be allowed to dig in further. Your longship, is she ready? She awaits her own special glory. They need your words, Abel. Oswald was a man who didn't hesitate when you sought him for favors. A man who was fair and strong. A man who gave his life for his kingdom. Honor him today. Honor his memory. And fight with the same extra courage he showed! For us! For us! For us! Now is the time. Today we rid East Anglia of Ruid's clan once and for all. Remember the dream I spoke of? You sailed through Helheim on a ship of fire. Here, it may come to pass. Dreams. Life. Maybe they are one and the same. Tonight, I ride the flaming sea steed, rushing for the spear beam. I watch her light and waters wake. Another glory I will keep. Ready yourselves. Ruid's shit stains will see us coming. Men, we bring Helheim to our enemies. How nice! They greet us with some of their own from the air. Arrows! Odin's hell! Our oh, sword maidens take them swiftly. Close one, that was! Keep your shield arms limber! Hold for impact! Skeldon! Hold! 
to open these gates! Charge! For Oswald!
Listen, Twig Spine. <clears throat> Stand fast. This will be over soon. Worry not for me. You must stop. <clears throat> Silence, fool. So this is what it comes to, Wolfkist? Two Danes fighting over a filthy Saxon whore, son? This swine is your prize. Come and get him. <clears throat> Saxon and Dane alike. You, you slave of God. Pathetic! You dare try and bed my Valdez?
Thank you. You'd throw in with these wastrels? These Argir swine? For what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Eivor, no! He should be tried before God, a lawful assembly. <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands. To rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? The rightful king of East Anglia has spared your life today. And so it will be. Compassion is a virtue suited for anyone, Eivor, including you. Thank you. Well, heathen. Not bad yourself, Saxon. <laughs> we did it! I can't believe we did it! And Oswald yet lives! God is truly merciful! <laughs> 